Hey there, Verbling. I hope you're all having an excellent day today. My name is Lauren, and this is an intermediate or maybe beginner, whatever level you want, of uh, pronunciation class. And all levels are welcome because we're going to be using tongue twisters to help us practice. So the, they're always fun, and I can see that Blanca and Hamid are back for more. <laughs> Hi guys. Hey mom. Hi. And hey Blanca. Oh, Blanca, can you hear us? Blanca? Maybe mm. her hangout is loading. Yeah, that's a good yeah, that's true, Hamid. Well Hamid, how are you? I am very well because yeah. time is eighteenth July in my country. So do you remember uh, its importance? 18th of July. No, I don't. Please remember from yesterday. It, is it? Wait. So if it's if today's my 17th and it's Wednesday here, you said your birthday's on Thursday. So tomorrow. So for you, it's the 18th. So it's your birthday today. Yay! Yay! Welcome, Hamid. Thank That's you. so exciting! Yeah. Yay! I'm so happy to hear that. Give me one second. I have a fly in my room, and it's flying around my feet. And I just opened the door, so hopefully it will leave. <laughs> Hamid, that's so exciting! Did you have dinner with your parents? Uh, I will eat after this uh, lesson. Okay. I ate. I, I ate my dinner. And I will eat my uh, night meal after this lesson. Right. Wait a second. What time is it for you? Isn't it morning for you? No, it is 1 a.m. for this moment. It's 1 a.m. Okay. So you get your night meal after this lesson at yes. 2 in the morning. Yes, uh, maybe near 2. Uh, 3 a.m. and I will be uh, hungry and thirsty until uh, 8, uh, half past 8 uh, p.m. for evening. Amazing, amazing. You know, um, when does when does Ramadan stop? When is it finished? Uh, there is uh, three weeks more. Three more weeks. Well, Hamid, are you available on Sunday? I'm teaching or. Saturday, I'm teaching some classes, and maybe we can do one on Ramadan. Maybe I'm not sure uh, if, if it depends on one situation. Uh, this situation is uh, about my brother because he will uh, come back from Germany, Turkey. Mm -hmm. but, uh, I'm not sure if I am free. I will uh, try to join. Of okay. Course. Yeah, let me know because that would be a great one. I want to learn about it. Okay. Mm hmm. Great, great. Okay. And let's see uh, if uh, Blanca, is your microphone working? Hmm. Blanca, we can't hear you today. I hope everything's okay. Um, hmm. No, we can't, Blanca. I see you typed in the chat. No, we can't hear you. Nothing. You can hear us. Maybe um, are the settings on your computer? <laughs> You're screaming. <laughs> are the settings on your computer? Um, maybe they maybe they are off. Like maybe uh, it accidentally turned your sound off. So check the settings on your computer. Maybe there's settings up here as well. Yeah, okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, you will be suffering. <laughs> um, okay, and welcome as well to Aichu. Hello, Aichu. Hi, Lauren. Hi, how are you today? Not really good. I have a cold. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, no. How bad is it? Really bad. Headache oh. and all this stuff. <laughs> oh, God. Do you yeah. have Advil? Yeah, I took uh, two in, uh, in, I think, two hours ago. You took two? Okay, so hopefully that'll make it a little bit better. 
Yeah, I hope so. Yeah, that's all I do when I've got a cold. Advil, Advil. I pop yeah. it. We say popping pills. <laughs> it's exactly. What, yeah, popping pills like it's candy. <laughs> Just kidding. That's bad. That's what you say about bad drugs. <laughs> Can you hear me? Oh, yes. Now we can hear Ivanka. Oh, great. <laughs> I don't what know was... what happened. <laughs> That's so strange. Yes. I don't know. Maybe my computer wants me muted. Maybe. Yes, maybe. <laughs> yeah, because it knows that you're about to suffer all the way through class with the tongue twisters. Yes. yes. It's oh your my favorite. God. Yeah, I'm just reading the description. <laughs> yeah. You didn't know it was tongue twisters? No, yes, but not the whole description about your your <laughs> when you have oh. to, to say some Spanish tongue twist, right? And you were kind of mad, yes. Because I, I thought they were bad. Yes, you were blaming me. No, <laughs> I'm an angel. Um, Hamid, did you see? Oh yeah, you've got it there. <laughs> okay, awesome. And um, we've also got Josue. Welcome back, Josue. Hi. Hello. Hi! That's such a cute display picture you have there. Yeah, it's really cute. I also think that. Oh, what are those? Are they snow? Snowmen? Yeah, I, I believe so. Mm, and they are holding an art. I, I think it is cute. Yeah, it definitely is cute. Oh, nice, nice. Great, Um, and we also have Hubert. Welcome back, Hubert. Hi, how are you? I'm great. I'm great. How are you doing today? Fine, fine. Great, Thank great. You. Excellent. And welcome back to Luis. Hello, Luis. Hi, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm excellent. How are you doing? I'm good. Great, great. Um, and welcome back as well to... Oh, mine has gone. Mine, I hope it wasn't something I said. <laughs> um, so hopefully not too many connection problems today. Um, okay, so this is what we're going to do today. I have posted the link there, and I'm sure in a, just a moment, Hamid, oh, there it is. <laughs> I was going to say in a moment, Hamid will repost it for us. So thank you, Hamid. Um, I love them. I want to ask where is my cake. I want to blow it. You want to blow it? We'll find one for you. Here. I wish there was a cake that had... Here. Oh, I got a cute one. Okay, ready? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do you like dogs? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe? Okay. This is your cake. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, Hamid, I want you to think of what do you want this year. I don't know what you do in Turkey, but in Canada, when it's your birthday, you make a wish. Okay, do you make I a wish in Turkey? I wished, uh, can I say it? Mm -hmm. I want to my uh, I want to make my PhD in abroad. You want to what? I want to make my uh, PhD mm -hmm. in abroad. Abroad, nice, Hamid. That's so amazing. Which country? Uh, first of all, Germany. Uh, I want, and uh, second, uh, secondly, USA or Canada. Oh, that's amazing. So would you take it in English in Germany or German? Uh, it depends on the situation, but English uh, opens to all, the, all doors, you know. Mm -hmm. Not, not, not uh, obligation for German. When mm. I uh, go to that, uh, the teachers or the uh, situation provides to learn a German for me. Mm, okay, I see. Okay, and Hamid, I thought I had already posted it on my wall, but I have a YouTube video um, that I thought I had posted on my wall, like as a happy birthday to Hamid, so I don't have it. I posted it yesterday after class, but I guess I didn't. 
because I'm just on my Facebook page now and I didn't. Okay, I'm going to post something after class, okay? Okay. Okay, and at the end of class, everyone, we have to sing Hamid's happy birthday. <laughs> okay? okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> can't wait to sing. And I, I, will, I will remind you. You better, because I, I promise we'll make, we'll make time. It's important. You okay. sang happy birthday for me. Okay. Um, okay, so I'm just getting my tongue twister document open. So everyone click on that link over there. And um, I noticed Mine, you're here. Hello, Mine. Hello, Lauren. Hi, how are you today? I am fine. How are you? I'm great. Just Good. trying to get my um, document up. I have like a very small computer. And it looks like it's getting slower. I have too much verbling stuff on it now. So I'll have to change that. Um, okay, and I noticed that Basma joined us as well. Hello, Basma. Hello. Hi, Hello. how are you? Fine, thank you. Enjoy. Great. I'm excellent, thank you. Okay, so this is our document that we're using today. Um, and really, you can go to any sound that you need help with. So let's say, for example, you want to practice your TH sounds. I just typed in TH sounds, and we've got all of these here. So it totally depends on which sound you want to practice. Okay? So who would like to go first? Oh, and I noticed Chow joined us as well. Hello, Chow. Hello, hello. I was always considering why do you ignore me. Oh. Chow, it's because, I, you know, Chow, I... was I, the only one who have the camera. <laughs> it's true. I just, Chow, I just don't like you very much. I see. I understand. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, and was that Mine? Did you say you wanted to go first? Yeah, I want to go first. Great, great. Okay. So here we go. Which sound would you like to practice? I think TH sound is my best sound I can. <laughs> my weakness sound, actually. Your weakest sound. Yeah. Okay, great. Okay, let's start you off with this first one here. 333 tips throw that they drill the throw throughout Thursday. What does it mean? <laughs> <laughs> well, the meaning isn't as important. <laughs> okay. Okay, when you see this here, let's say the. The. Yeah, when we say this, when we pronounce this as the, we normally only pronounce that as the if we're talking, if the next word is a vowel. Okay. Okay, so like the apple, the apple, instead of the apple. But this one is 33, so we're going to start with, um, with the. Let's the. try that one more time. Okay. The 33 tips throw that they trill to throw throughout Thursday. Okay, good. So the, the sounds that you got really good were the longer sounds, like Thursday, throughout, 33. Those ones were good, but when you get to, let's say, one-syllable words, I notice that you turn it more into a T, like teeves, taught. Right? So the yeah. only way to make that TH sound, and I'll show you on my face, is to really stick your tongue out. Say that whole thing with your tongue as far out as possible, like this. The 33 thieves thought that they thrilled the throne throughout Thursday. Really stick that tongue out. Yeah, I, my tongue can always stick out. <laughs> <laughs> Let's Otherwise try again. I say <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's try it again. Okay. I, I'm going to give you a new one this time, and I'll put it in the chat. Okay. Um, there are those thousand 
thinkers were thinking how did the other three thieves go through. Now when we've got the, we don't want that one to become da. Right? So what this I is did. Yeah, what you said da. Hmm? I said da. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, and the reason is because your brain has seen that word so many times, it's like, I say that word correctly, no problem, right? But, but that's the most commonly mispronounced word in terms of the TH sound because, right, it's such a small word, you don't remember to pay attention to it. So let's try that whole thing again. Okay. Uh, there, those thousand thinkers were thinking how did the other three thieves go through. Good. Excellent, Mine. And Mine, why don't we practice that R sound as well? Through. Through. And when after you do the TH, so after yes. Z, don't let your tongue tap the top of your mouth. A tap means a tiny little touch. Okay. So, so if I'm doing this, I'm tapping my nose. Just tapping yeah. means tiny touch. So I don't want your tongue to tap the top of your mouth. When it taps, this is what this is what it sounds like. Thru. It's like a th do, but we want to hear thru. Okay, I will try one more time. Thru. Good, good. And it's always good to slow it down. Keep it slow until you're comfortable. Then yeah. speed up. Do it again. To roo. Okay, excellent. And now try it a roo. little bit faster. To roo. To roo. Okay, excellent. Much better. Much better. Right? The main goal is we don't want to hear that thadu with that D, right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> awesome. Awesome, Mine. Okay, who's the brave soul to go next? Me, birthday child. Birthday boy. <laughs> okay, great, Hamid. Which sound? Our sounds? Uh, I want to try the, uh, the longest sentence. Is it possible? You want to try the longest sentence? Yes. Which one? You can ask... ask Select for me. Any kind of long sentence, you mean? Yes. Okay. 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 I've got I've got something in the chat there for you. A little present. Okay. Your Rory birthday present. <laughs> okay. Rory the warrior and Roger the, the warrior were reared wrongly in a rural brewery. Rabbi Rugby's brother bought and brought her back some rubber baby buggy bumpers. <laughs> good, good. Let's hear that again. Rugby? Rugby. Rugby, good, good. And let me hear, oh, see that verb there? Reared? Reared? Yeah. So not rear red. And have you ever seen that verb? It's kind of a strange verb. Reared. Mm, to I rear? I don't think so. This is the same as uh, talking about children. Uh, if you say, I'm going to bring up ch my children. Hamid, you've heard that before, right? Yes. If you're going to bring up children, you're going to raise them. Another way to say that is to rear children. Okay. So if you ever see that, that's what that word means. To rear children means to bring them up. Okay. Great. Okay, let's try that one more time. Okay. Um, oh. And this time, try to make your R's a little bit uh, more natural, if that makes any sense. So instead of saying Rory the warrior, try to go a little bit quicker, just a little bit quicker. Okay. Rory the warrior and Roger the warrior were raised wrongly in a rural brewery. 
Rabbi Rakpis brother bought and brought for big sum rubber baby buckley bumpers. Good, good, excellent. And let's get that word there. Brewery. Brewery. Good. Do you know what a brewery is? No. A brewery. Who knows what a brewery is? Beer? Yeah, good, yeah. Of course, Blanca, you would know that. <laughs> no. Bad. I'm <laughs> Well, it's okay. I'm bad too. Brewery, <laughs> yes. This is where um, beer is made. Okay. The, when we talk about making beer, we say brewing beer. Brewing. It sounds when it when I say it quickly, it sounds like brewery. 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 At the brewery, they brew beer. Say that, Hamid. Brewery. Good. Good. At the brewery, they brew beer. Try that, okay. Hamid. Can you say it again, please? Yep. At the brewery, they brew beer. At the brewery, uh, the beer. I forgot. <laughs> like that. At, At the brewery, the... they brew beer. At the brewery, uh, they uh, brew uh, beer. Good, good. Okay, awesome. So that's perfect, right? That's how. That's that strange R. When you have it after a B, it's really hard. Brew, bur, brown. Say brown. Brown. Yeah, it's a strange R. Okay, but your R's are really good, Hamid. And let me give you another one. Okay. Try this one. Okay. William always wears a very warm woolen vest in winter. Victor, however, will never wear woolen underwear even in the white vest. Okay. So let's get those V and W sounds just a little bit more, specifically your V sounds. When you see Wild West, keep those lips. Far in front of your teeth. Ooh, wild West. Wild West. Good. Good. Wild West. Okay. Wild West. Good. Good. Those W sounds are also important. Uh, let's hear you say very warm woolen vest in winter. It's just there in your tongue twister. Okay. Uh, very, very warm woolen vest in vi winter. Good, good. So those V sounds are the same as an F, and, uh, but you're going to make it a voiced F. You know how in TH sounds, Hamid, we have the voiced and unvoiced? Can you say one example uh, for this? Yeah, like there's there's this sound, and then there's the voiced, when you hear a voice with it. So instead of, we hear, mm, yeah. like, like bee's voice. Mm -hmm, like a bee, yeah. So this is the same. The word uh, fall, or let's say file, file with an F, if you make it a voiced sound, so you vibrate, you bring your you bring your voice out at the same time, it becomes the V sound. V, and you really gotta bite your lips when you make that sound. Victor. 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 Good. 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 And I think that'd be a good sound to practice, Hamid, is those those W V's. Okay. Okay, awesome. Uh, everyone's saying happy birthday to you. <laughs> um, Josue, I see that you've given me a funny Italian tongue twister. Yes, I guess that is the most difficult one. But I are those supposed to be all one word? 
Mm, yes, they don't really make sense, but they have a meaning. But uh, but it is really funny to <clears throat> to hear uh, Italian <laughs> keeping trying to say that, and also foreign. Uh, I teach Italian, and. Um, and in my classes, I also give sometimes tongue twister because they are good for pronunciation. Mm -hmm. And uh, in this one, there are a lot of R, and that's really a problem for a foreign speaker. Uh, mm -hmm. They they can say this R like we have mm -hmm. in Italy, and so it, it's really fun. Okay, and, I'm going to try you know, <laughs> okay. I'm going to try it, okay? But I don't speak any Italian. <laughs> okay, don't okay. worry. Say la r wait, like that? R uh, yes. R okay. La r oh my goodness, there is a fly in my room right now. Okay. Do you know what a fly is? Yes, unfortunately. A little, a little insect <laughs> that's just oh I hate it. Okay. Um okay. Say lar larci larci vescovo di Constantinopoli si Disarvi si vesco visco tan tino posilazazeti. Oh my gosh, that's not a word, is it? <laughs> well, it's it's <laughs> not not really a word. They just keep you know they just um, unite two or three words together to make it more difficult. Oh. But okay. in Germany they are more difficult. I live there and. They usually uh, say one with one word. They say a full sentence, you know, yeah. and they they can be really difficult. And uh, I just wanted to show you one. Uh, that is from the place where I live. I'm not from that place. Um, you know, I migrated here, mm -hmm. but that that should mean something in the local dialect. <laughs> That's crazy. Ah, uh, oh, ah. Uh. E e o e i e e. Yes, like I don't ask me what it means. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I can't do those. But now it's time for you to suffer as yeah. well. <laughs> <laughs> what sound do you find most difficult? Um, as every Italian, the H sound. H sound. Mm -hmm. I just put H where I shouldn't and. Uh, forget where I should read them and pronounce them. Oh, so where do you normally put an H? Everywhere, you know, <laughs> because it sounds very English to me. <laughs> mm, okay, so when you say H, you mean like... I'm like trying home, to think of... You know? Oh, home, like that. Mm -hmm. Oh, like that. Okay, here, let me see. I don't know if I have any H sound. For example, mm, oh, mm -hmm. that's German. Um, for example, we I would read home. I don't always do, but I would also read something like that. Har, you know? And mm -hmm. I, and there is no H sound there, but I read, you know, that har. Okay, so... Yeah, I've heard that before. I'm just um cuz I'm trying to look for some of these. Uh mm -hmm. Let me know. let me see if this one works. Okay. Uh so, uh her wall, right hand really hurts. Okay, that that second word is actually just an H sound, whole. Oh, okay. Okay, <laughs> do you know what that word means? Do you know what that word means? Yes, I'm uh, not whole, but um, the yes, whole. Okay, that that's right. Yeah, whole, whole mm -hmm. means like the whole thing, and it sounds the yeah. exact mm -hmm. same. As whole, spelt H O L E. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and they they actually sound the exact same. So, um, when you make your H sound, first of all, um, I don't know how 
to help you correct to stop putting it at the beginning. And that's really strange because we don't have a nate sound in Italian, even hotel, we we read hotel and not hotel. And I don't know why I put have that I mind. know, and you're right, many Italians do that. Well, okay, let's work on your H sound though. Instead okay. of pushing your tongue, so right now your tongue is up at the back. It looks like this. <laughs> do you see that? Can you see my <laughs> Okay? Yeah. Like this. But we want your tongue to be completely flat. So instead of saying her whole we're going to see this, tongue down, her, her, ha, her, whole. Your tongue is actually supposed to be down. Try that. Oh. <laughs> her, and keep oh. that tongue down. <laughs> but they can't see a word. Okay. It sounds like nothing. Oh. It sounds like air. Oh. Her. Push your tongue Her. down. Take a pen, okay? And push uh -huh. your tongue down. Uh huh. Her. 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 <laughs> Her. Okay. Good. No, that was it. Do it again. Her. 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 Hole. 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 Good. It's just. Air. It's like you're just breathing. You're saying, mm -hmm. ah. Okay. Okay. Exact same. So we don't want to hear her whole right hand really hurts. We want to hear her whole right hand really hurts. Just a little bit of air. Ha. Ha. Hurts. Mm -hmm. Good. Good. Okay. Let me give you another one. Okay. I hope I will have my tongue by the end of the class. <laughs> yeah, it's true. I'm having a hard time getting words that start with H. I guess there aren't many. Okay. It's okay. Don't worry. No, I'm worried. Okay, I've got it. Because I don't have all of the sounds, I guess. Oh, here's one. Okay. Okay. Okay, say that one for okay. us. <coughs> Harry, hand, hand. Keep that tongue down. Keep uh, it yeah. as low as possible. Remember, it's just air. Okay. Harry, hand, Hands, heavy, hairy, hairy, hairs. Okay, good. Did you hear that with hairy? We just got a tiny sound there. That's perfect. It's so quiet, you can barely hear it. Hairy, hunt, hunts, heavy, hairy, hairs. Mm -hmm. One more time. Okay. Hairy, hunt, hunts. Heavy, hairy, hairs. Okay, so we've got that tongue still kind of going up. The best way to stop that is by putting something in your mouth. So yeah. if you hold your tongue down, it will start realizing how to stay down. Okay, mm -hmm. Josue? Okay, thank you. Okay, I, you're welcome. I will okay, great. Okay, who wants to go next? Me. You do Basma. Great. Basma, which sound is most difficult for you? R, I guess. R. Okay, great. Let's get some R sounds going here. Okay, let's give this one to you first. Rabbi Rugby's brother bought and brought her back some rubber baby buggy bumpers. Good! Your R's are excellent! What? Your R's are really good. Okay, let me give you another one. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah! 
I'm hearing a bit of an echo. Um, I think it might be coming from Josue, so I'm just going to mute you, but it didn't stop. Hmm. I don't know where I'm hearing the echo, but if anyone's not speaking, if you could just turn your microphone off for now. That would be great. Okay. And yes, Mohammed, this is a live chat. Um, okay, Basma, go ahead. Read the next one I put in the chat there. Mm. Rory the warrior and Roger the warrior were reared wrongly in a rural brewery. And let's get this one. Reared. What? Reared. Reared. Mm -hmm. Sorry, everyone. I'm just going to mute everyone until it stops. Oh, I think it might have been coming from Ubert. No, it wasn't. Let me try. Sorry, everyone. I'm just going to mute you all because I'm, I'm hearing this sound and it's very annoying. <laughs> Okay, maybe it's coming from Basma. <laughs> Basma, I'm going to try muting you for a second and just see if maybe that's where it's coming from. Oh, no. Okay, so it is coming from Basma. Okay, so Basma, we'll continue this right now, but after we'll keep you on mute. Okay, take yourself off mute now. Okay. <laughs> okay, it looks like your R's are excellent. Um, say the word this, uh, brought. 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 Okay, brother. Brother. Excellent. Excellent. Your R's are really, really good, Basma. Thank you. Yeah, oh my gosh. Why did you think you needed help with those? <laughs> because it was hard <laughs> when you failed oh. the first time. <laughs> well, here, let me give you this one. I mean, these are maybe some more difficult R's. Mr. Tongue Twister tried to train his tongue to twist and turn and twist and twat to learn the letter T. Okay, good. And you know, maybe we can practice some um, sounds. Do you like TH sounds? <laughs> I don't know. Well, you're going to find out. <laughs> There's a tongue twister right there in the chat. <laughs> The 33 thieves thought that they thrilled the throne throughout Thursday. Okay, let's hear 33. 33. Instead of tree, I don't want to hear tree, like a tree in the garden. Uh, three. Three. Yeah. Good. Good. Three. Um, sometimes three. people with an with an accent, like for example in Newfoundland, sometimes they say tree. Like they'll they'll say tree instead of three, but this isn't um a good habit to get in unless you're a native speaker. So so don't do that. <laughs> okay. Great. Um also with little words that you're very used to, like that and they and the those ones are the most difficult because you forget about them. Yeah. Right? So I was hearing da instead of the. Right? So why don't you try that one one more time? Yeah. And and uh, let's get every single th sound. The thirty-three thieves thought that they thrilled the throne. Throughout Thursday. Good. Is that difficult? Yeah. <laughs> it is, right? Okay, good. Here, one more. There are those thousand thinkers who are thinking how did the other three thieves Excellent. Go Excellent. Good. So when you're thinking about those TH sounds, your pronunciation is excellent, Pasma. So just think about them. Like really always think about your TH sounds and they'll improve. Same with the R sounds. Okay. You're okay. welcome. Thank you're welcome. You excellent. Much. Okay. Okay, who wants to go next? <laughs> okay, I'm going to pick someone. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, Chow, uh, are you gonna go? Yeah. Great, great. Okay, so Chow, which uh, which sounds do you uh, think you have problems with? 
I actually I have problem with L. Um, mm. So, yeah. L sounds. I'm gonna be so mean. Okay, ready? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, not that one. Sorry. Okay. There we go. Okay. Just give me a second. My verbal chart is frozen, so I need to copy it to. Yeah. Okay. Luke Lark likes Lakers. Luke Stark likes Lakers. Luke Lark li likes Lakers. Luke Stark <laughs> likes Lakers. Stark <laughs> takes leaks in Lakes. Luke Lakes. Lark likes Luke Lark <laughs> takes leaks in Lake. Dark likes. Okay, that made no sense. Great L sounds. Those were so good. Okay. Okay, no one about this one. Those L's were really good, by You're the way. You're mean. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Plasma, I'm the meanest. <laughs> um, okay, go ahead. Go ahead, um, Chow. Okay, just one second. Mm. Okay, so Lanky Lawrence lost his last and lobster. Did Lanky Lawrence lost his last and lobster? If Lanky Lawrence lost his last and lobster, where is the last and lobster lobster Lanky Lawrence lost? <laughs> okay, awesome. So your L sounds are excellent when you're focusing on them, right? Actually when the L is in the first, in the beginning of the word, it is okay for me to pronounce, but if it is at the end of the word, so I just have problems oh. with that. Oh, okay, here, why don't you say this for me then? It's when the L is at the end of the word that it's most difficult? Literally, literary. Good, good. Literally literary. Literally, literary. Yeah. <laughs> okay. What about the word a lollipop? A lollipop. Lollipop. Okay, good. Lollipop. Go one more time. Lollipop. Good. Okay. I'm looking up something. Um. Okay. Are you ready for some words? Yes. I'm so mean. I know. All animal actually annual offer bill ball bell bow beneficial. Okay. So you know what our problem is, Chow? Yeah. Um sorry Santiago, please don't uh, ever say things like that in the chat. <laughs> there we go. Um, sorry about that, everyone. I should have a delete button, but I don't. It's not working. Um, anyways, so, Chow, when you've got that sound there, the L at the end of the word, you're actually turning it into an O. So instead of saying animal, you're saying, you're saying animo, animao, animao. And instead of turning into an ow, Let's get that tongue between your teeth, just like the TH sound. But if you think about putting it there for the L, L sound, it'll do the same trick. Let's say animal. Animal. And instead of sticking your, your, um, your, mo your lips are becoming an O. So even if your tongue is there, we're only hearing O. So try to keep your tongue like this. Your 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 face open like this. Animal. Animal. No. Nope. Instead of Anim animal, here watch yourself. Watch yourself when you do okay. it. You're saying animal. Oh, so keep your lips smile animal. at me. Ah. <laughs> animal. Animal. No, it it is just a habit. So <laughs> pull your face back like this. <laughs> okay. Okay. An <laughs> animal. Animal. Oh, stick your Anim tongue out. 
Animal. Animal. Okay. <laughs> it didn't work for me. It did. It did work. What you just need to do is remember, if your tongue goes like this, mole, even if your yeah. tongue is between your teeth, it won't do it. Yeah. Your mouth has to be open. And remember, tongue between your teeth. Slow it down. Animal. Animal. Okay. Mole. Mole. Okay, there. No, now we're hearing that L sound. Okay, so that's the important thing for you is to remember your mouth has to be open. It won't work if it goes to the O position or else we just hear actual instead of actual. Right? Okay, actual. Actual. Good. That L was perfect. Actual. Actual. Good. So whenever you realize, oh, now I'm going back to my O sound instead of my L, just remember, open up that those lips. Right? Actual. Actual. Ball. 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 Good. Ball. Good. Good. So tongue between your teeth, mouth open. And it works really well when you're in front of a camera or a mirror. Excellent, Chow. Yeah. Does that make sense? Okay. Sure. Thank you. I was just, I was thinking it was a problem with me. So, yeah, it is. I would focus on it. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. It's not a problem with you. It's just a problem with your, let's say, your technique. So now that you're going to change your technique, the yeah, problem is sure. solved. Sure. Thank Yay. You. <laughs> okay. Great. Who wants to go next? Okay, fine. I too, you can go next. I knew you would pick me. <laughs> okay. I too, what would you like to um what would you like to practice? Which sound? Uh last time you told me I have to practice the R beside the consonant. Mm, yes I did. Okay. Sorry, give me one second. Okay. I'm trying to look at for my uh Okay, I'm gonna get you to do some of these with T R, okay? Okay. Okay, try that one first. Okay. Trace, track, terrible. Good. Trace, track, terrible. Okay. I'm looking for my document right now on my computer that um, that has all of those sounds. Um, is it phonetics? Yeah, phonetics class. Sorry, I'm looking for, I don't have that list of words on this list here. Oh, it's okay. I don't have them here. Okay, I'm just going to start thinking of some for you. Okay. Uh, let's do... Okay, say these ones for me. Brought, bring, brought, trouble, Treble, let's say eh, treble. Treble. That's a music word. Okay. Now let's hear this one. Here, let's let's also get some vowel pronunciation in here for you. Compare these two words. Trouble and treble. Good, good. Uh and eh, trouble and treble. Have you been practicing your R beside consonants? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, well, good. It's definitely paid off because I remember the 
a word that you had trouble with was barat. Yeah. You were saying barat, barat, barat. <laughs> okay, let's get this one. And you can say the one that Hamid wrote too. <laughs> Thank you, Hamid. Triple. <laughs> triple. Triple. Eh, triple. 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 And not tree, but tri. Eh, triple. Triple. Good. Okay. And um, let's try this one here. The next one that I put. So try the first celebrant. Celebrant. Good. Greenly. Greenly. Good. Or green. Green. Brown. Brown. One more time. Brown. Excellent. Excellent. I chew. Your practice has totally paid off. Do you feel better about them too? Yeah, a little bit. Oh my gosh. Well, you're, as far as I can hear, every single one you've done have been perfect. Thank you. You're welcome. Your new sound that you can start working on is your I sound. Okay. Okay, so instead of saying, uh, what was the other word we were looking at? Uh, uh, triple. Yeah. I, triple. We don't want to hear triple. We want to hear that I sound. Okay. So that's uh, your next sound you can work on because your R beside a consonant is beautiful. Thank you. Awesome. You're welcome. Okay, who wants to go next? Okay, fine. Blanca, if you want to go next, you can go next. Don't get so excited. Blanca, are you there? I'm not excited. <laughs> you know what I'm going to give you, right? No. Your best friend, Peter. No, that's what Ella told me. No. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, but I know Peter really misses you, so... No, even on vacation, I had to say that one. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> Peter. Okay. Peter Pepper picked a pack of pickled peppers. A pack of pickled peppers. Peter Pepper picked. If Peter Pepper. Oh my God! It's move. Sorry, I have to because. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's more. Yeah. It, it I, I'm also gonna put in the in the Google chat if that's better for you. Yeah, because. <laughs> okay. Sorry. That's okay. Peter Pepper. Peter Pepper picked a pack of pickled peppers. A pack of pickled peppers. Peter Pepper picked. If Peter Pepper picked a pack of pickled peppers, where's? Oh my God. Where's the pack of pickled peppers? Peter Pepper picked. Excellent, Blanca. And actually, that name is Peter Piper. Piper. Peter Piper. Yeah, but it looks like that I sound. But remember how I said sometimes it's the I sound? Well, it's, it's almost always the I sound when we have I consonant E. Oh. I consonant E. So that one would be Piper. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Same if I had the word like Pipe. Right? I oh, consonant E at the end. Yes. Pipe. Okay, why don't you try that one more time using uh, I, Piper. Peter Piper picked. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickle. <laughs> Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. A pack of pickled peppers, Peter Piper picked. If Peter Piper picked a pack of Pickled peppers. Where's the pack of pickled pe peppers Peter Piper picked? Excellent. Oh my gosh, Blanca. And to think, two months ago you could barely do the sound. <laughs> okay. Oh, amazing. Okay, now there's one last one just to make me laugh. Um, I wish to... Just to make you laugh, okay. <laughs> I wish to wish the wish you wish to wish, but if you wish the wish, the wish, the wit, oh my god, move again. <laughs> Sorry, I have to pass because it has moved. 
Okay. I wish to wish the wish you wish to wish, but if you wish the wish the witch wishes, I won't wish the wish you wish to wish. Beauty. Beauty. Look at that beautiful if sound, Blanca. And you know, you can tell that you had to say that other one, the Peter Piper one, a million times on your vacay because uh, it was perfect. So that's so great. Is there another sound you wanted to look at? Um, I don't know what I had to work on. You know better than me. I have to be honest with you, Blanca. I'm really impressed with your pronunciation. I, I, I don't think there's a sound that I can, um, that I can pinpoint in your in your speaking that really needs help. Like you really needed help with that i sound. Um, uh, I, I have one sound. Uh, the other day, Samantha told me in class that the all sounds or something like that. All sound? Uh, yes, like this. No, this. Ah, uh, like this. Um. Like full? But I can't remember the word. Fall? Yes. No, the, it's this. I, I don't know, but maybe it's the next class. Through? No, through, no. Throw? Hmm. Like book? No. Oh, uh, oh yeah, book. Yes, but it was another one. I can't remember. Okay, yeah, find out which one that is. Maybe... Mm -hmm. Maybe it'll make sense. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Um, because, I mean, for you, I think that the best thing for you to practice is um, um, I think tongue twisters are really good at really getting your brain to wrap around certain sounds. But, um, of course, vocabulary would be a good, um, a good thing for you as well, just improving your vocabulary. That. I'm on that. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Um, okay. But... Uh, I just wanted to say, I, I'm going to get to Hubert and Luis, but I'm unfortunately I'm going to get to you a little bit late, because right now I just want to make sure we get to sing happy birthday to Hamid before we end class. So I'll, then I'll get to Hubert and Luis. Okay, everyone, it is Hamid, our special friend's birthday, and um, he's a very dear student and friend of all of ours. He's always helping everyone and friendly to everyone and remembers everyone's birthdays. <laughs> so let's all sing him happy birthday. Everyone get your microphone. <laughs> okay, everyone has it? Okay. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Hamid. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Thank you very much, Lauren. <laughs> I have a very beautiful voice, right? Yes. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> okay, Hamid, if you need to go, that's no problem. Um, uh, just one uh, request. Uh, can I uh, say most to Tongo Twisters? Because it is about to wish. Yeah, go for it. Okay. I wish to wish the wish you wish to wish, but if you wish to wish the wish wishes, I won't wish the wish you wish to wish. And let's get wit. That witch. 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 Good. Good. It's your birthday wish. Yes. I get it. Clever. <laughs> Perfect. Um, okay, everyone, I'm going to be starting my next class a little bit late, um, but my next class will be about... Um, what is my next class about? <laughs> um, it's going to be on two different sounds. We're going to be talking about the difference between shut and shot. So, uh and ah uh sounds. Uh, maybe that's what you were talking about, Blanca. So, I'll meet you all there. I'm just going to stay here with Hubert for a little bit. Um, okay, Hubert, which sounds would you like to work on? Well, I have problems with the TH sound, like those sounds. Yeah, okay, here, let's get you some TH sounds. TH sounds. So let's get this one here. Um, this is a good one. So with that TH sound, you just want to stick your tongue out of your mouth. And not just out of your mouth. It needs to go between your teeth. Okay? 
So this whole time, just stick your tongue between your teeth. Okay. Go ahead. <laughs> okay. The thirsty three thieves saw that they filled the throne throw through. Good, good. No, you're doing excellent. You're doing really good. Hubert? Thank you. Oh, wait. No, no. Keep going. Let's hear this. Throughout Thursday. Yes. Through, throughout throughout Thursday. 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 Okay. Through, throughout Thursday. Good. Good. So that's that TH sound. Let's try this one here. <clears throat> okay. Thirsty three, thirsty, thundering, thorough breath. Mm -hmm. Thumped Mr. Thumber on Thursday. Oh my God. Good, good. So, Uber, try that one again, but do it faster. This is when it gets difficult. Oh, faster. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Thirsty three. Thirsty, thundering, thorough, bread, thumped, Mr. Thumber on Thursday. Good. And again, faster. Try, faster. try it a little okay. bit faster. Thirsty, three, thirsty, thundering, throw, bread, thumped, Mr. Thumber on Thursday. Good. Good. Okay, so these are the types of things that really, really help you. So let's do that one again, but even faster. <laughs> okay? Let's let's get those yeah. syllables happening one after the other as fast as you can. As fast as you can. Okay. Thirsty. Okay. Thirsty three. Thirsty thundering. Thorough breath. Thumped, Mr. Thumber on Thursday. Good. Good. You should copy and paste these and say them until you can say it like this, okay? 33 thirsty thundering thoroughbreds thumped Mr. Thurber on Thursday. Okay? Oh Try to say it that <laughs> fast. And by if you do it a lot, you can do you'll be able to in a few days. Okay? Hubert, your tongue is just a muscle. Okay. It's just a muscle, like your like the muscles in your arms. So the more you work with it, the stronger it becomes. So if you practice that sound every day, you will have no trouble. Okay, you bear it? Okay. I okay. Agree. And here's a one more that I want you to do and then I'll I'll end class. Okay. That one. Throw three cheese, three, third, three, please, blue. Good, good. So we've only got three TH sounds in there. Through three cheese trees, three free fleas flew. One more time. One more time. Okay. Through three cheese trees, three free fleas flee. Oh. Good. <laughs> so that's why they're tongue twisters. So Ubert. Copy these. The, the chat will always be on our website, so if you don't copy them right now, you'll, you'll see them later. So, so definitely um, copy and paste those and keep practicing them, okay? Okay, thank you. Okay, okay Blanca, go ahead. Okay, I'm going to paste. <laughs> okay. This is your favorite sound. Okay, but it's not bad, right? No, nothing I wrote uh, is bad. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Whew, I need some water. I don't write okay. bad things. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay. Oh. 
R con R, guitarra, R con R, baril. Mira que rápido rutan las ruedas rodan, rodondas del ferrocarril. N con R, cigarro, R con R, maril. Que rápido corren los coros levando el azúcar del ferrocarril. Yeah? Was it good? <laughs> oh, it's perfect. Per See, I'm really good at reading Spanish. Yes, your air sound, air sound is really, really great. Thank <laughs> Better you. Better than me. Stop <laughs> it. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a definitely, I have no idea what I just said, but um, I trust you. <laughs> Okay, yeah. everyone, I've got to get to my next class. Blanca, but you see, even when I mess up, it's okay. I'm learning. Yes, but it's almost perfect, but maybe, maybe you're, you you have to work on your air sound. <laughs> maybe? Maybe, yes, maybe. A little R bit. con R. R con R. R con R. Guitarra. <laughs> Guitarra. Oh, you see, you're improving. R con R, guitarra. R con R, barril. 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 Yes. Yes, oh, the, I love tongue twisters. I, I would do this all day if I could, but I can't. I'm seven minutes late. I must leave. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Goodbye, everyone. Um, Bye. Uh, my next class is on the difference between a uh and a uh sound. So I'll see you there. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye. <laughs>